Okay guys, today for a little while this evening, uh, I had to work again all night last night, so we, I didn't get to hunt much this weekend, but I'm back over here by the ballpark at, at, uh, in Fair Park again, our park over here at Hope, and uh, Hope, this park is a pretty old park, but it's been hunted to death, <coughs> oh, excuse me, but uh, Anyway, I started down through there the other evening, and it got dark on me, down through the woods. What I was going to, uh, we used to have a guy that had a coin shop here in Hope, and he told me that that old creek was real, real old. And so uh, I noticed the other day that they had cleared some of the bushes back away from that, from the creek just a little ways down there. What, uh, what, it ain't a very big patch, but I thought I'd try to hunt that spot where they had cleared and I ain't made it down there yet, so that's where we're headed. And I'm gonna work my way down there, hoping before it gets dark. Get back with y'all if I find anything good. Well, I just found part of an old lock, but it's it's not really that old. It's uh, brass. But anyway, I'll get back with y'all if I find anything else. Guys, I found an old bottle dump down here in the middle of the park. And uh, most of the bottles have, so far I haven't found any whole ones. I found some like this right here. This one here's got Hot Springs, Arkansas on it. Egger, Eggerwood Brothers. And uh, I got one in my back pocket. And I've got a top to one of them in my shirt pocket. And I'm going to have to be careful not to cut myself. These broken bottles are all over the ground everywhere out here. This one here says Hope Arkansas on it. And uh, anyway, uh, I'm getting a signal right here. It's a good signal. I'm gonna dig it and see what we got. We'll be back, get back with y'all in a little bit. Now you guys, I think y'all recognize what this is. I think I, I think this is what I'm thinking it is. If it, 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 I don't know, it, uh, it's a relic come out of the ground right here on top of where all this bottles and glass is. And if you'll look, there's glass everywhere. I'm kneeling on glass. And, uh, but uh, I'm thinking that probably went on them tops because they're not screw tops, okay? The top I got in my pocket, and I'll show you, and I got another one laying there somewhere in the dirt that I'm going to get and try to match to these bottles. But they're, these tops are not screw tops, okay? So these bottles are old. I'll get back with y'all later. Guys, look at this. There's just glass everywhere. Bo broken bottles, old broken bottles everywhere out here. This is an old dump, I guess. I'll get back with y'all in a little bit. And uh, I did find the brass, some kind of brass screw on top. I don't know what that is. That ain't got nothing to do with them bottles, though. I just dug that. And I want to show y'all something else. I just found a whole bottle. And it's old because it's not screw on. But the embossing on it is about, well, there ain't no one, I guess it's wore off. It's, but anyway, it's a whole bottle, and I'm going to keep her. Get back with y'all if I find anything else. Guys, now I want to show y'all just how thick this is. This is another bottle I found laying on top of the ground. It's got Hope Arkansas on the part of it. But look how thick it is. Man. That was the bottom of the bottle, I guess. Get back with y'all to find anything else. Well, we didn't do much good down here at the creek. And uh, I'm going to work my way back up there towards some bottles and get some bottles and head towards the truck. We'll get back with y'all in a little bit. <laughs> you all know what that thing is? There's several of them right here on the ground. If I ain't mistaken, it's a boat arc ball. There's about three of them right here. There must be a boat arc tree here. Well, I'll get back with y'all in a little bit. Give you a better look at it. It looks about the size of a softball. <laughs> get back with y'all in a little bit. Guys, I wish you could. I, did, I started back up here towards the old ball dump, 
and there is glass everywhere, broken bottles everywhere, and some half broken. I mean, look at that one, you know. Uh, and then there's one right here by my foot. See, look at there. And, there, and I mean, they're just all under the leaves. All this stuff is under the leaves. I wish I could find some that are embossed whole. But I'm getting a. I, I got a good signal right here. Sound like a good signal. It's a dime quarter reading. It's jumping from dime to quarter. If y'all can hear that. And we're gonna dig it. Get back with y'all in a minute. Guys, there's my find. It's a a spoon. A little spoon. Look like a baby spoon almost. And I bet that dude's silver. Uh, it might not be, but it's coming out of the ground shiny. It was amongst all this glass. I don't know if there's going to be anything on it or not, because half the handle's broke on it, but we'll get back with y'all if we find anything else. I'll get back with you and let you know if it's silver. Guys, we're going to have to come back. There's just too many bottles not to be any whole ones here. I'm literally walking on top of, of old glass and bottles. I can feel these. Do you see them there? All these leaves are covered up. Got these bottles covered up. And I'm walking on top of the leaves, and you can see. I mean, I can feel the bottles underneath the leaves. Just walking on top of them. Uh, we'll have to come back because you know there's bound to be some some intact here somewhere. Look at that. There's another. I got my got my mother sucker on top of it. This is real, unreal. Well, anyway, I'm coming up on my bottles. So I'm, I'm gonna keep these. Some of these got embossing on them, even though, even though they're partial. Uh, I got some tops, and maybe we can glue them back together. I don't know, or stick them back together some way. And we're gonna have to come back down here. There ain't no doubt about that. But there's some whole bottles here somewhere. I mean, there's look there. There's glass embedded in the base of that tree. All right, we'll get back with y'all later. There's a lot of them old bottles. I brought them back here to the truck. I mean, I don't know if I can do anything with them or not, but we'll take a look at them. But hey, this one here's got Hope Bottling Company on it, or Bottling Works. It says Hope Bottling Works, Hope, Arkansas. But it's got the top broken off of it. And this one here. Well, it's got this circle on it where the embossing would have went, and it's uh, got a it's a whole bottle. It's got a little chip right out of the top of it up there. All right, and uh, this spoon, I just bet you anything, is silver because I can see some lettering, and I don't know whether you can or not, but. There's some lettering on it right there. I don't know what it says. Can't tell. But we'll get at home, clean this sucker up real good, and look at it through the magnifying glass, and then I'll let you know on the video. That's neat. At least I found something. I bet that is silver, though. Coming out of the ground looking shiny like that. Okay, get back with y'all later. I wanted to show y'all this here thing too. I don't know if that's got a, if that's got anything to do with a, a lid or come off of a jar or something or what. 
or can, but it looks like it's got some writing on it, so I'm going to take it home, clean it up, and see what that's all about. So he's got some writing on it. I can't really tell what it says. But I'll get it home and look at it better. Get back with y'all find anything else. This is Lula saying good luck with your hunting and God bless. Hello.